you, um, I think, are one of the more innovative IT operations that I've seen. I mean, a lot of that is you're driving EMC innovations, mm -hmm. particularly the journey to the private cloud. I mean, mm -hmm. that's something that your CIO, Sanjay Merchandani, who we've had on the Cube before and we'll have him on later this week, has talked about. But I wonder if you could talk about your, your journey sure. to the private cloud, where sure. you're at, and, uh, and we'll dig into it a little bit. Yeah, so we've been on the journey for a long time. So it's kind of uh, you know, not one of those things that happens overnight. So, um, you know, for, first of all, uh, we, we set a, a target of 100% virtualization. So virtualization is key to getting to the private cloud. Um, we're, we're a huge believer in leveraging our existing core assets, and virtualization has really allowed us to look at legacy applications, consolidate onto ERP like SAP and others. Um, and, you know, th but virtualization is only one step, right? So, the, we, you know, the private cloud, um, you know, is all about enabling the business and driving results. So that's kind of a, the end state. IT is a service as an end state. So virtualization, job one, which we've done. App tier, middleware, database, reporting. So you think about SAP, not only does it include ERP, it includes reporting with business objects. And we're virtualizing every tier in the stack. And so that's step one. So once you get, vir get virtualized, great. So what? Well, you know, you've got, you, you drive a lot of benefit. You drive savings with respect to hardware, with respect to labor, with respect to energy and so forth. But again, the, the, the big value add is accelerating our ability to enable the business, right? Getting capabilities out there in shortened time frame.